Welcome back to Cars Jade. Today, we've got exciting news straight from Toyota. After years of speculation, the 2026 Toyota Helix EV has officially been greenlit for production. This marks a new era for one of the world's most popular utes, transitioning from its traditional diesel and gasoline-powered lineup to an all-electric version. Let's dive into what we know so far about the upcoming Helix EV and why this could be a game-changer for both Toyota and the electric vehicle market. Toyota has finally confirmed that the 2026 Toyota Helix EV will enter production by late 2025 in Thailand. This comes after some reports suggested the project had hit roadblocks, but Toyota's executive vice president for Asia, Praz Ganesh, has now revealed that the EVU is in its final testing phase and ready for production. With Thailand being one of the key manufacturing hubs for Toyota, this electric Helix will also be produced for export markets including Australia, which has been eagerly anticipating the arrival of this zero emissions youth. Developing a fully electric version of a rugged utility vehicle like the Helix has its own set of challenges. Toyota has been meticulously testing the EV model in both hot and cold climates to ensure that it meets customer expectations for performance and durability. According to Ganesh, the main hurdle lies in balancing battery capacity and vehicle weight as adding larger batteries increases the weight, potentially reducing the load capacity of the vehicle. We're always trying to understand what the customer needs, Ganesh said. This focus on user experience is at the core of Toyota's EV strategy ensuring the Helix EV can still serve its purpose as a workhorse, whether it's being used in construction, farming, or off-road adventures. Toyota's move to electrify the Helix isn't just about keeping up with trends. It's a direct response to the influx of Chinese electric vehicles entering the Thai market, one of the largest for pickup trucks. As competitors like Isuzu have already announced their plans to build an electric version of the D-Max, Toyota is keen to maintain its market dominance. Last year alone, the brand held an impressive 34.3% market share in Thailand, selling over 265,000 vehicles. The Helix has been a major contributor to this success, so an electric version could solidify Toyota's stronghold in both the Thai and Australian markets. While Toyota has been tight-lipped about specific details for the Helix EV, early testing indicates that it will aim to deliver the same rugged reliability as its gas-powered counterparts. The focus will be on providing a balanced driving range while keeping the vehicle lightweight enough to maintain its utility capabilities. This means we can expect a vehicle that's not only environmentally friendly but also fully equipped to handle tough jobs, heavy loads, and even off-road conditions. The introduction of the 2026 Helix EV is more than just another vehicle launch. It's a major step in Toyota's global electrification strategy. As one of the world's leading automakers, Toyota has been somewhat cautious in its EV rollout, focusing heavily on hybrids. But the Helix EV shows that the company is ready to embrace the all-electric future, especially in segments where it has historically dominated. And with the production of the Helix EV, set to begin in Thailand, we could be seeing this electric ute hit Australian and global markets by 2026. The 2026 Toyota Helix EV is shaping up to be a bold move for Toyota, introducing one of the most iconic utility vehicles into the electric vehicle space. With production kicking off in late 2025 and testing already underway, this EVU could redefine what we expect from electric trucks, combining Toyota's legendary reliability with the green tech of the future. Are you excited for the electric Helix? Drop a comment below and let us know your thoughts. And don't forget to like and subscribe to Cars Jade for more updates on the latest car releases and automotive trends.